Greetings, Gemini. So I'm coming to you with your reading. This will be a quick reading, so let's get started. Um, let's start with your astrological houses. So I did clarify each house using the Kipper Oracle and the Zillage Tarot. I will link them down below in the description box as well. And I also will leave a link to a free natal chart just in case you want to go through and check your houses. It is definitely helpful. Okay, so um, next and also Spirit is urging me to make this, to say this. I hear a lot of people talk about astrology, you know, astrology and, you know, how it's bullshit, but you have to look into your natal chart. You cannot just look at your sun sign and your moon sign. Look into your natal charts and I promise you it will change your mind. Okay, so moving along. The first house you received was creativity. This is the fifth house. Um, the I did, like I said, I used the Kipper and the Zillage deck to clarify each house. So for creativity, the house card came out. The number 20 could be of some significance. And then we have the star card that came out from the Zillage. The number 17 could be of some significance. So um, I feel like something surrounding um, what you do uh, work-wise um, or something you love to do, okay? Um, I feel like that this can bring in, um, and house two could be, I'm picking up, could be talking about body-wise, okay? Like your temple, okay? Um, but uh, something surrounding your creative side or being creative, okay? Uh, next, we have sex. This is the fifth house. Um, we have pathway. The number 35 could be of some significance. We have ace of swords. This brings in clarity. Okay. Um, and then we have adjustment. And this surrounds judicial matters. Um, the number 11 could be of some significance as well. So something about... Um, uh, some I'm picking up... Um, Something, something along this path will bring clarity surrounding um, sex. It's definitely take what resonates, what doesn't. Don't make it um, fit. And I feel like whatever this is surrounding sex could cause some legal matters. I don't know what the hell, but I'm just going with what I'm picking up, okay? So, I feel like something is going to bring clarity um, surrounding something sexual, and um, it could bring about some legal matters, okay? Next, we have religion, faith, divine, and God. This is the ninth house, okay? Um, you receive judication, the knight of pentacles. And then the Nine of Wands, which talks about strength. Okay, so I feel like, like I said before, something sexual is bringing about legal matters. Um, and I feel like, um, like right here, I feel like this is going to involve you having strength. Okay, having just, you know, just keeping the faith and um, knowing or, or just know um, that everything will, you know, be okay. Okay. Um, and for some reason, I'm hearing spirits that don't fly off the wall. I don't know why. But uh, so let's move along with your <laughs> healing frequencies. Okay, so firstly, we have Tibetan healing sounds that you received. This is great for meditation and healing. It cleanses the aura. It relieves stress and it um, helps relaxation and calming. Next, you receive water sounds. This helps with sleeping, focusing, studying. It reduces stress, and it's um, used during great to be used during massages. Next, we have Hertz 528. This is great for transformation and deep healing. It repairs DNA. It helps with the solar plexus. Um, it does um, help with whole body regeneration and miracles. 
Next, we have Hertz 639. This is great for rebalancing positive energy, relationship harmonization, connecting relationships, connection and reconnection, and it's great for your heart chakra. Okay. So next up, we have your angels. So, um... The first card you're receiving, and if you're new to my platform, bear with me when it comes to these angel cards, y'all, because I'm still trying to get these names together. So the first angel you received was Men Menadale. The date September 8 18th through the 23rd could be of some significance. And Angel Menadale encourages employment. Then we have Archangel Heniel. Archangel Haniel, the angel of joy, she works to direct people who are searching for fulfillment to God, who is the source. Okay. Then we have Angel Rahael. The dates October 4th through the 8th could be of some significance. This angel heals the sick. Okay. So this goes back to up at the top when I said something surrounding um like bringing clarity as far as sex is concerned and this could bring in um some legal matters okay i don't know if i'm not even spirit telling me not even to say what i was about to say so i'm gonna leave it alone okay so next we have random words and uh the first word you received was approval then you received the word current and then we have friend, okay? Then we have the words table. And next we have look. And then um, example, okay? So approval and current came out. I experts to clarify. They clarified it with the word friend. So a friend could have approved of a current situation. Or a friend could be, um, could be being approved for something. Okay, then we have table and we have look and it was clarified by example. Okay, um, next we have your rainbow random words. The first word you received was reconcile. Next we have meditation or yoga. Then we have journey. Next we have Scorpio. Then we have black. Next we have cigarette smoker. Then we have fake friends. So um, you you can um, have Scorpio placements, Gemini, or um, you can be a cross watcher who's a Scorpio. Next, you received Ogun. Then we have study or read a book. Then you receive clear courts. Next, we have children. Um, then you receive just a um, affirmation card. And on this card, it says five daily reminders. Number one, I am amazing. Number two, I can do anything. Number three, positivity is a choice. Number four, I celebrate my individuality. And number five, I am prepared to succeed. Okay. Next, you receive the word Jezebel. Then we have jealousy. Next, we have Taurus. So um, you can have Taurus placements or you can be a Taurus who is a cross watcher. And lastly, you received drug use. So that is everything I have for you, Gemini. I hope you enjoyed this reading. If you did, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Gratitude for supporting my channel. And I will talk to you all in the next reading.